Good evening. We start tonight with schools around the capital area shaping their final health plans as the fall semester starts with masks mandated plus testing and vaccines available. News 2's Nadine Abusada breaks down what districts are deciding. Sylvia, superintendents tell me their main priority is the safety of the kids and the teachers, but remind everyone they've done this before, so they're more prepared than they were last time. Nearly a week before the first day of class, EBR schools partnered with Our Lady of the Lake and the Louisiana Department of Health to inform everyone of their new COVID protocol. This year, teachers and students are required to mask up. Routine COVID tests will be available for staff and students with parental consent and virtual learning is an option. If a parent does not feel comfortable for their uh, child to be in person, then we will have, we have an easy process for them to be in the virtual school. And our virtual school is a pre-K-12, also with a magnet component. Vaccines are recommended but not required. The district says they also have protocols in place if students are exposed or catch the virus. While at St. Helena, the school year has already started with today marking day two. It's no different than last school year. You know, our students know that they need to come in with their masks. We also provide masks for our students if they need them. So. We're fully prepared. We also have air purifiers that we purchased that we're going to put in the classrooms. St. Helena schools returned with in-person classes and are hopeful they won't have to go back to virtual. I can't predict the future, but I'm tell I tell you what, we hope we don't have to go that route because we know that face-to-face -face is the best option for our students. The superintendent reiterating that last year prepared them for this, so they are geared up but remind parents that they can also help to stop the spread. I am a parent of a school-aged child. And uh, I am just as concerned as any other parent would be. Uh, but I made sure that my child got vaccinated. I made sure that my child has all of the equipment that she needs to be fully prepared and to be safe while, you know, on school grounds. Zachary schools will also start Monday with in-person classes and requiring masks. Sylvia. Nadine, thank you.